Welcome to Ridge Life, I'm Tim, and today we are traveling, traveling to Come On Mountain, the first of our four day adventure here in Arkansas. We're gonna start off uh, making our way over to Come On Mountain to see David from Come On Homesteading. Then of course, we're gonna be helping Simple Life Reclaim get their trusses up on their new cabin in the woods on the 41.36. We'll visit uh, Country Road Cure, uh, Drifting Dreamers 5, uh, hopefully Drew's Lens, Into the Mist, uh, Mama V, Possum Run Homestead, and even Groovy Eggs Farm, Jeff Bobblehead Homestead. So it should be an awesome trip this week. This is day one, the travel there, and uh, getting a quick tour of Come On Homesteading. So I hope you enjoy. On the road, headed back to New Orleans Driving in the country, past old tiny scenes Big birds were singing in the tall willow trees Mighty fine Three words written on the paper bag I miss you written in a message in black thrown in a van two thousand miles back a better time and how many souls and times that I've told the places it had want to be and how many days I could have stayed Instead of just getting up to leave And given we make time I'll meet you down the line mm. A long coat Walking on a New York street A pack of crushed cigarettes that fell to her feet Well ain't it odd how some people meet But that's the truth And two pictures buried in a guitar case Underneath the music sheets all over the place I caught a glimpse of the sweetest girl's face I ever knew And how many souls and times that I've told The places that had lacked to be And how many days when I could have stayed Instead of just getting up to leave And given we make time I'll meet you down the line Then, if they never seem to come or to go, well, find me in your memories that keep you from getting so low. And given we make time, I'll meet you down the line. Down the land, we'll meet up down the land. Down the land. 
about time you made it battle of the cameras man we, we're both dressed comfortably today aren't we look at this we're not we're not homesteaders we're we're, we're, we're relaxers what's aren't we on, bro? what's up man what's made going it. on go ridge life i think i had to stop at every cow and every horse and every flower and every river it's beautiful out here <laughs> even the sun guys it was supposed to be a hundred percent chance of rain today it ain't rained since this morning man it rained hard coming from memphis over into little rock and then i come over here to come on mountain country it's beautiful it's still pretty it is beautiful, man. So get the mountains behind. Come on, mountain. Ooh, baby. That's that's my view I'm working on right now by clearing. <laughs> well, let's get the ladies' truck unloaded. Yeah. Into the man's. Yeah. Pretty truck. Well, it's a Chevy truck, so it's got to be a pretty truck, you know. It is pretty. Neither of these are Ford, so unfortunately. Uh, uh, hey, you're not gonna hear no complaints from me. I'm a, <laughs> I'm a Ford guy myself. <laughs> man, I am happy to be on Come On Mountain. So let's do this. Come on. Well, we made it out to Come On Mountain, and the first thing I want to do is give David a gift from my mom, Grandma Carol. She said, it rains a little bit on the mountain, from what she could tell. And you know, with that creek kind of coming up just a couple inches, you know, so she wanted to give him this rain gauge. So she got one. Uh, she said, uh, put this up and you'll know exactly how much rain you get. So David, there's a rain gauge from Grandma Carol. That's awesome. Thank you very much, Grandma. <laughs> <laughs> I actually, I need this. I don't have a rain gauge, so that's awesome. <laughs> So this tree right here is Mike's favorite place on Come On Mountain. That's where he decided to park his truck in the middle of the river in a flash flood. A user or a subscriber sent me a sign that says, turn around, don't drown, come on. And I'm going to put it on that tree. <laughs> so there's the other kayak stranded on the island. <laughs> Whoa. The water was that high. It, it was above that. That kayak was floating in a tree. Wow. Yeah. Right here's a good place for you to be there. You made a few changes since I've been here, buddy. Yeah, one or two. <laughs> one or two. Man, I see old Glory still flying though. Oh yeah. She 
been taking a beating with all these storms. <laughs> Man, you got some trees clear. Those are some decent sized trees. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> those ain't like your little sweet gums. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, those just pop out of the ground. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> That stump right there weighs as much as your SRV. I guess I guarantee it. <laughs> mm -mm -mm. Wow, man. Lots of work going on out here. Yeah, a lot of clearing. Hey, look at that rider. Well, you know rider's gonna come supervise what's, what's happening. <laughs> rider says- You the star of the show, rider? Huh? Meow. Rider says, she's this guy? Meow. Meow. Got some goats over here? Yeah. The goats, they're professional YouTubers. They have an outhouse. <laughs> well, they have an outhouse, but we don't. Yeah. Ryder goes with you everywhere, huh? Oh, yeah. Got some baby goats. <laughs> oh, guys are cooties. <laughs> now what's the names again? Uh, this one right here. Is Coco. Coco. Icy. Icy. Chief. Chief. And Chanel is the mama. And big Chanel. <laughs> Woo. You smell like Chanel, Chanel number five, girl. So you ladies have your own outhouse. Too bad a homesteader doesn't have one. That's uh, not needed. I prefer to look at the mountain. <laughs> Drifting dreamers down. Drifting dreamers down. Man, this was a nice truck too. Yeah. Too bad. Man. Totaled by Come On Mountain. Could not take the heat. Look at that. Man, oh man. It's brutal out here, huh? Oh yeah. Some nice logs right here, man. Yeah. Gonna make some nice siding for the. You're gonna finish that, right? No. You're just gonna leave, do do three sides and stop? No, I'm just doing one side. Just one side. Just one you side. you're you are you set your goals low. Yeah. I'm a big <laughs> fan of lows. <laughs> <laughs> man, look at the look what we got here. He got a piece of wood up here. I might be able to do some sawing. Be my first time at a sawmill. My goodness, guys, what do I see through the woods? I don't have my telephoto lens on here, but look at that. I've got quite the mountain view myself if I ever get it cleared out. Look at that dead tree, man. That is a big old dead pine. Oh, yeah. Widowmaker for you. You got another one right back there. See that bark missing on it? Two, three right there. Oh, man. Plus about five right here. So they're everywhere. They could take you out for sure, couldn't they? Oh yeah. That one right there is good. Oh, I see it right over. The one beside it's good. Yeah. All of these are going away when Uber comes back. Simple mm. Life Reclaims coming over and we're cutting all of these. And then we're cutting these right here, getting ready for the septic tank for the tiny house. Nice. That way when people like Tim come over, that's a little city. Uh, <laughs> we'll have a place to use the restroom. That's hilarious. <laughs> Alright, so give me the tour of your pump house. This is a pump house, right? That's all we got here is a little, just a little pump house? That's what it started as. <laughs> <laughs> what we got going on here? Uh, this right here is going to be the actual pump house part. That's the door to go in there. You'll see when we get inside, it's separated. This right here will be the outdoor kitchen. I'm actually milling cedar for the trusses for this. And that way I can put the roof on and have real nice cedar. The outdoor kitchen will be here. 
all out in here will be all rock and gardens and stuff I'm doing a big mushroom right here and doing a gnome garden and the old shallow well here I'm taking a bunch of the boulders that's around the creek down there stacking it up and doing a waterfall I'm gonna let it recirculate through that shallow well that way there's always water there so this would be a whole entertainment area go into the humble abode and look at this pump house wow yeah. this right here is going to be the solar room it's a pretty big solar room the room back there there will not be a door here that's the generator room back there i will actually be staying here whenever i redo the cabin i'll be putting my bed in here we got the bathroom in here And that's was the original plan to start with. Yeah, this, there's the pump. Yeah, that was the pump house. It's and now we've got a kitchen, washer and dryer go here. We, we got, got a shower. Shower. Woo! Look at this shower, guys. Man, that's pretty sweet. That is big. A lot bigger than people <laughs> understand. Yeah. Nice. Now show me this sink here. Yep, basically all you gotta do is push the button, the hot water heater turns on, and the water's already hot. Wow, that I mean that you don't have to it was already you turned on everything, you got uh, propane right. onto the check it out, here's propane. Here's this hot tap water heater. That is sweet. Instant hot water. Instant hot water. Rides it up to the shower. Red line goes in there. Sweet. In instantaneous. It's so hot. And it lasts as long as you got water and you got propane. That's it. <laughs> oh, I missed it. Do that again for me. Do that Rider. again. <laughs> Ryder, what are you doing? What are you doing? Ryder normally talks on the van. We're talk? We're talking me? You the king of the castle there, Ryder? So I know I gave you some backstrap last time. Have you eaten it yet? Nope. Not yet. All Not right. Yet. So you got backstrap. We are getting some rabbits prepared for you. you yes. Know, I just mated the rabbits on the ridge. And uh, just to give you a taste of what's coming, nice. I've got a fresh frozen rabbit that we just uh, uh, butchered, processed uh, about a week or two ago. So get, yeah. get this cooked up and uh, see how you like our rabbits. I might cook that while you're here. Let's do it. That way I can get some tips. <laughs> All right, let's go inside the cabin and see what we got. What's changed since I've been here last? Wipe the feet off. Everything. Everything, it sure <laughs> has. Man. Wow, look at this. It feels a little different. It does. Very nice. Got the couch. Got a heater, because heat rises. Heat rises, look at that. You got George up there. At your workstation. That's where all the magic happens. Ooh. There's the bedroom, the that's boudoir. Where, that's where not a lot of magic No happening. magic happening in there, huh? <laughs> <laughs> and there's the upstairs loft bedroom where I'll be uh, staying. That's your abode. For the next well, now you got a new kitchen over here. Yes. Doing right, huh? What you doing, huh? What you doing? Where you going? Where you going? Where you going, huh? Where you going? Oh, you're such a good kitty, yeah.
hope you enjoyed today's journey to come on mountain wow what scenery i hope the new camera and the new lenses hope i didn't mess up the exposure hopefully it all turned out beautiful for you uh, you got to see david you got to see a quick tour of come on mountain i know you've seen a lot of it before uh, but we're going to see more of it this week i have got four full days here and of course we'll be over at the 41.36 very very soon so don't miss a video because there's going to be tons of content over here in Arkansas with all your favorite family YouTube channels. So hopefully you enjoyed this one and stick around for more. So guys, until next time, hope everyone has a blessed, blessed day and go Ridge Life. We're going to visit all kinds of people and we're going to have people like Ryder visit us as well. So enjoy the show today. This is day one, traveling to come on mountain. <laughs> all right, you're sweet. So